back to Definitely Not Definitive. I'm Ken. And I'm Bethany. And we're just a married couple in love that loves the MCU. Yeah, we do. Yeah, we do. And Loki came out. The Loki series trailer uh, is, is out. It, we had like a little teaser trailer before, but now the official uh, trailer for the series is here. Loki's one of our favorite characters. He's kind of like my spirit animal in MCU. <laughs> What does this about you? He's kind of a villain sometimes. You know, he's a little mischievous, so, you know, I mean, it's all right. But he's, he's a fun guy, right? We like Loki. He's a fun guy. He is a fun guy. All right. Here goes. I know what this place is. Timekeepers have built quite the circus. And I see the clowns playing their parts to perfection. Big metaphor guy. I love it. Makes you sound super smart. I know. Smart. I know. Okay. Okay. Please sign to verify this is everything you've ever said. This is absurd. <laughs> we protect the proper flow of time. You picked up the Tesseract breaking reality. I want you to help us fix it. Why me? I need your unique Loki perspective. Do I get a weapon? Yeah. <laughs> Black Will. Yeah. That looks so fun. I'm so excited for this. That looks like, I mean, a, a kind of a cross between uh, what WandaVision was and what fucking the Winter Soldier is right now. Um, just kind of, it, it's like, I think it's going to have a little bit more action than, than WandaVision did, um, but it's still going to deal with some kind of out there uh, concepts like, you know, multiverses and, you know, the time variance, authority, these, these different kind of elements that we're not going to be used to. They're bringing back Black Widow. That totally looked like Black Widow. It did. It did. But something, something's got to be up. Something's, he's fixing some timelines. So. Well, yeah. So Loki broke reality, which yeah. seems fitting for Loki, yeah. of course. Um, and now we're dealing with all the different branches that come from that. And it was interesting because as, as they talked about that and you saw the little trail with little like veins basically mm. going off of it, it did look like two of them that had branched off from the main were actually going to converge. And that, like, as I was looking at that, I was like, whoa, like, what does that mean <laughs> if that happens? Like, I mean, it just... It and who was the person in the cloak? Who was the person in the cloak as well? That's the one thing I noticed. I mean, she notices more things like that, like the little, the, the cooler things, the time going like this. The nerd stuff. Yeah, and if you saw the Space Jam uh, trailer reaction, she asked, she, she spotted the Game of Thrones. And Drogon was in that one, too. And we, I, I completely missed that as well. I don't know how you missed the big flying dragon, but I did. <laughs> well, I think I, I noticed the dragon. I was not aware that it was Drogon. I, I mean, like, in, yeah, in yeah, sort yeah. of the way that it was animated, stuff, I was not 100% certain that that's who it was, but it's good to know now that that's who it was. Yeah, she, she was right. I, everyone, everyone said she was right, so it's all, it's all good. <laughs> Thanks, everyone. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so let us know down in the comments uh, what you're excited for with Loki, and um, if you have any theories, just theories. We don't want any spoilers. No, no spoilers. spoilers. No spoiler alerts down below in the comments. We just want theories, you know, out, out there. And um, just keep in mind that our reaction to Loki is definitely not definitive.